your hub for accurate, timely, actionable information. Seasoned investor or novice, we've got you covered. Welcome to FundCode. Stocks to overarching market trends and strategic investment insights. Stay tuned for our feature presentation on NTPC Limited, a leading player in the Indian power sector. The latest price of NTPC Limited is RS353, 85 marking an increase of RS12 dials, 1 or 3.54 percent. Now, this recent movement in price is quite intriguing. NTPC Limited, once known as National Thermal Power Corporation Limited, is an Indian public sector undertaking primarily engaged in power generation. Their business model is cleverly designed to pass through changes in fuel costs thanks to long-term power purchase agreements for their plants. This approach helps to regulate revenue and profit based on invested capital, incentives and a rate of return under a transparent cost plus model. Recently, NTPC Green Energy Limited, a subsidiary of NTPC, signed a joint venture agreement with Uttar Pradesh Rajya Vidyut Utpadan Nigam Limited. This partnership aims to develop renewable power parks and projects in Uttar Pradesh, a move that could potentially influence the company's future performance. The stock's momentum continues to be strong, with the price maintaining above short, medium and long-term moving averages. NTPC Limited, previously known as National Thermal Power Corporation Limited, operates primarily in the power generation sector. As an Indian public sector undertaking, it plays a critical role in meeting the country's energy demands. The company's business model is unique and robust. It is anchored by long-term power purchase agreements for its plants, which allow changes in fuel costs to be passed through. This means that fluctuations in fuel prices don't necessarily impact the company's bottom line, offering a degree of resilience against market volatility. Moreover, the company's revenue and profit are regulated based on invested capital and a rate of return, as well as incentives. This is guided by a transparent cost plus model. At its core, this model ensures that costs incurred in producing electricity are covered, while also allowing for a reasonable rate of return. Now let's move on to some exciting company news. NTPC Green Energy Limited, a subsidiary of NTPC Limited, has recently signed a joint venture agreement with Uttar Pradesh Raja Vidyut Upadan Nigam Limited, this partnership is set to develop renewable power parks and projects in the state of Uttar Pradesh. This is a significant stride in NTPC's journey towards renewable energy and aligns with its strategic vision of sustainable growth. Renewable energy is the future, and this venture further cements NTPC's position as a forward-thinking player in the power generation sector. This move not only helps diversify NTPC's energy portfolio, but also contributes to the broader goal of expanding India's renewable energy capacity. In a world where sustainability and renewable energy are becoming increasingly important, NTPC is showing a clear commitment to these ideals. The company's strategic moves are a testament to its adaptability and readiness to embrace change, which bodes well for its future. These developments reflect NTPC's commitment to renewable energy and sustainable growth. Now let's delve into the fundamentals and technical analysis of NTPC Limited. Starting with the fundamentals, the company's EBITDA to sales ratio is a key point of interest. This ratio is relatively high, which translates to high margins before depreciation, amortization and taxes. What does this mean? Well, a high EBITDA to sales ratio suggests that NTPC Limited is profitable and efficient in its operations. Let's also consider the company's price-to-earnings ratio, or P.E. ratio. At 16.98, this ratio indicates that investors are willing to pay just under 17 times the earnings for each share. This suggests that investors are optimistic about the company's future earnings growth. Moving on to the shareholding pattern, it's essential to note that promoters hold 51.1% of the shares. This is a clear indication that the promoters have a significant stake in the company showing their confidence in its potential. Moreover, Foreign Institutional Investors, or FII, and Foreign Portfolio Investors, or FPI, have increased their holdings from 16.69% to 17.05% in the last quarter of 2023. This increase signifies the growing interest of foreign investors in the company. However, it's worth noting 
that mutual funds have slightly decreased their holdings from 19.34% to 19.14% in the same period. While this decrease is minimal, it's an aspect worth keeping an eye on. Turning our attention to the technical analysis, the stock has shown strong momentum with the price above short, medium and long-term moving averages. This upward trend is a positive sign for investors and indicates the potential for continued growth. Despite some decrease in holdings by mutual funds, the overall fundamentals and technical analysis point to a positive outlook for NTPC Limited. As always, it's crucial to do your research and make informed investment decisions, but from what we've discussed, it seems that NTPC Limited may be a company worth considering for your investment portfolio. Analysts from CLSA maintain a buy rating for NTPC Limited with a price target of RS37500. This vote of confidence from a highly reputed global investment bank like CLSA underscores the strong fundamentals and potential growth of the company. Crisil, a leading provider of ratings research and risk advisory services, has also affirmed its ratings on NTPC Limited Crisil's AA slash FAGA slash stable slash A1 plus ratings for the company's debt instruments, bank facilities and fixed deposit program reflect a high degree of safety regarding timely servicing of financial obligations. These ratings also indicate that the company has a robust business model and a solid financial structure. Let's now delve into some economic indicators. The company's EBITDR sales ratio is relatively high. This shows that NTPC Limited is able to generate a significant amount of earnings before interest, tax, depreciation and amortization from its sales. A high EBITDA sales ratio typically indicates that a company has strong profit margins, which is a positive sign for potential investors. Another key economic indicator is the company's price-to-earnings ratio, or P.E. ratio, which stands at 16.98. The P.E. ratio is a valuation ratio of a company's current share price compared to its per-share earnings. It's one of the most widely used metrics for investors and analysts to determine the market value of a company's shares. In the case of NTPC Limited, a P.E. ratio of 16.98 suggests that investors are willing to pay RS16. 98 for every R's one of earnings the company generates. This is a clear indication of the market's positive sentiment towards NTPC Limited. Given these ratings and economic indicators, NTPC Limited continues to be a strong contender in the power sector. The company's strong performance, coupled with the positive ratings from CLSA and Chrysler, make it an attractive option for those looking to invest in the power sector with a robust business model, solid fundamentals and favorable economic indicators, NTPC Limited is positioned to continue its growth trajectory. As we wrap up our analysis of NTPC Limited, let's revisit the key points. NTPC Limited, the Indian public sector undertaking dedicated primarily to power generation, is currently priced at 353.85 rupees. There's been a positive change in its value increasing by 12.1 rupees, a 3.54% increase. The company's business model is robust, with long-term power purchase agreements that accommodate changes in fuel costs. Its revenue and profit are regulated based on invested capital, rate of return and incentives, under a transparent cost-plus model. In recent company news, NTPC Green Energy Limited has formed a joint venture with the Uttar Pradesh Rajya Vidyut Utpadan Nigam Limited aiming to develop renewable power parks and projects in Uttar Pradesh. This venture is a promising step towards a more sustainable future. Looking at the company's fundamentals, the EBTA sales ratio stands relatively high, resulting in sizable margins before depreciation, amortization and taxes. The company's PE ratio is 16.98, indicating its potential for growth. The technical analysis shows strong momentum for NTPC Limited. Its stock price is above short, medium and long-term moving averages, suggesting a bullish trend. The shareholding pattern reveals that promoters hold 51.1% of the shares. Foreign institutional investors have slightly increased their holdings, while mutual funds have slightly decreased theirs. Analysts from CLSA and Crystal Ratings have given positive reviews, with CLSA maintaining NTPC at buy and a price target of 375 rupees, and Chrysler reaffirming it's Crystal Adale slash FAA slash Stable slash Chrysil A1 plus or ratings. In the end, 
the economic indicators also point towards a positive trajectory for NTPC Limited, with high EBITDA sales ratio and P ratio. Stay tuned to Funcode for more insights into your favorite stocks. Remember, knowledge is power in the world of investing. Before you go, though, we've got some fantastic recommendations for you. If you're into stock market news and updates, you're going to love these picks.